Did you know that the realtor you choose can vastly affect your success rate? Don't work with someone just because you know them or because you feel obligated. Now, whether they just don't know, they're careless, or they're just too busy, realtors can overlook big mistakes. And we have reputations. So if your agent is aggressive, lazy, or lacks communication, chances are other agents have noticed and they might advise their clients to overlook your home or overlook your offer because your agent is known to be too difficult and it could be a risky deal. The realtor you choose needs to do the research, have the knowledge, strategize and solve problems, have good connections, and be organized so that they can stay on top of those very important deadlines. They need to be creative, compassionate, and patient, while also being logical, bold, and persistent. They need to be both friendly and aggressive, which can be really hard to balance. Now, once you do choose your realtor, you must trust them. Our job is to give you all of the advice that you need to make your decision, as long as it's legal and ethical. But you have to listen to your realtor. I've had clients that didn't listen to me because they thought they knew better, and after months of seeing it for themselves, they finally caved, but they had lost time and a lot of money. So. Pick a realtor that you trust and listen to their advice. And it's okay to shop around. Interview two or three realtors. Now, any more than that, and that will just make your decision even harder. But find one that you click with, because this is going to be your business partner for the next couple weeks or couple months. Now, buying and selling are big investments, and it needs to be done right. So if you want my help and you trust that we will do a good job together, you can message me. Even if your plans are for years down the road, we can start talking and planning now. It's never too early.